What's going on guys, it's me Semi Mong and we are back on Albion Online. Today we're doing a bit of mount hunting and we're going to go through the process of how to get a dire wolf mount. So you can see the wolves are chasing me currently and it is a very long process or not very long, it is a very grindy process. So a dire wolf before I get into how to how to get one, it can be really expensive. In my time playing Albion Online, they've sold from a million to 1.9, 1.5. Like, you can get a fair amount of silver for the, the, the mount version. And I, I presume the same amount for the pup. Obviously, people are going to want to get the pup just as much as the mount so they can make the mount themselves. But to get the pup, you're going to have to do what I'm doing in the background, and that's actually kill some dire wolves. Now, usually you don't get any loot from these guys, you're just able to skin them. But there is a very low, and I presume very rare chance, that they can drop a dire wolf pup. Which from there, you can then just go to your island, put it in your pasture or your stable, however you want to call it. Grow it over 24 hours, just let it raise like any other animal, a chicken, a ox, a horse. Once you come back, you'll have a fully grown dire wolf and then you can take that to the saddler or the stable once again i'm, I'm pretty sure it's the saddler actually and then you can take that to the saddler and you're able to just craft a dire wolf mount like it's a pretty easy process once you've got the dire wolf pup it's just very grindy to get the dire wolf pup itself now these enemies are tier six and i am in a tier four area so i presume that you can find them in the lower level black zone areas there are some red areas that you can find them in, some red zone areas, sorry. But if you've got more consistent information on where you can actually find these, be sure to comment it down below. But you can see I'm fairly tough against them. Like, I'm using tier 5 gear. I can solo them. I can't particularly duo them. So if you're in tier 4, tier 4.1, you should also be able to come along and potentially try and get yourself a direwolf pup by soloing them. While I'm having to run away while I duo them, I do manage to run away, regain my health, and then come back. But other than that, any other abilities you're going to have to watch out for are the big AoE one that you just saw. And then also there's like a claw or a bite or something. It's a red cast bar under the dire wolf. I'm trying to spoil it out now. I don't think you'll be able to see it now because of the tree. But he does it a couple of tacks after this big AoE one. So just make sure you dodge that as well. Let me know in the comments down below if you're going to go try and hunt yourself a dire wolf pup. And whether you've actually already got one. Because I know once the game comes out, they'll be fairly sought after. But yeah. Guys, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram links are all in the description down below. If you want to go follow me on them, it would be really appreciated. But thank you for all of your support on the YouTube videos. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.